Okay, so we're at a restaurant called Singang Budu, and I heard that they have tempoyak here. So Steve and I are gonna try tempoyak today. Hopefully they have it, and they also have a selection of like nasi campur, which means like rice, and then you can choose your own meat or veggies. And they have a sambal called budu, which is like the uh, fermented anchovy sambal so we're gonna try that as well so let's see what they have whoa ivana your shirt looks like you work here <laughs> very cleverly dressed matching Sigangudu. I'm loving the yellow theme. You can see that through the whole place. For some reason at the front they are blaring music at like nightclub level volume. So it's kind of funny. But um, everyone's recommending tempoyak, so here we are. Look okay. At Steve plate. Here goes. Look at this. No fish, just chicken and beef and veggies. Look at mine. I got the I got the ikan bakar, which is barbecue pink fish. I'm not sure what kind of fish that is, but it got a filling inside. Oh, stuffed fish. Yeah, like coconut filling or something. I'm not Very sure. Very interesting. And some eggplants. And this is the tempoya. Mm. And of course, the tempoya is topped with patai, which is the stinky beans. Mm. So we tried it before and we really like the patai. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Whoa, dancing patai. <laughs> and we got a bunch of ulam. Ulam. Veggies. Oh, veggies. So, 32 ringgits for everything on the table here, which is not exactly cheap, but it looks so good. Yeah. Uh, I'm more than okay with 32 ringgits for yeah. all this. Let's try it. I want to try this. Let's go. Okay, tempoyak. With with rice or with... Uh... I don't know. Maybe try it on its own first. With the cucumber then. Mm. How is it? Whoa. It's... Uh, oh, I see. Thank you. Thank you. Let me see. Ivana, it's durian spicy. It's really good. Spicy? Very Is spicy. Is it like powerful? Whoa. 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 <laughs> Honestly? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's like a rainy day. I'm like slow this morning, waking up late. And now there's like a raging birthday party in my mouth. It's crazy. It's <laughs> spicy. Party. The durian flavor is not very strong. It's not as powerful as durian itself. Okay. But it's spicy and that cucumber is nice and crunchy. Nice way to get it out there. It's really good. Um, is it better than durian? No. No. But it's very good. It's like smashed durian? No. A little bit, but very spicy. Super spicy. Whoa. Nice. It's good though. How about rice? Show rice. Okay, try it with rice. Okay, better cucumber. Good. Better with cucumber. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> it's really good, Ivana. Nice. Whoa, it's so. You know what? Almost better with rice. Less spicy with rice. Less spicy with Less rice. Less spicy because okay. the rice kills the spice. The rice kills the spice. Rhyme time. Okay. It's good, Ivana. Good. Um. Is it five stars? Wow. Five stars. It's really good, Ivana. It's quite nice. I enjoy eating it. Better, I would eat it more and more and more. I thought I wouldn't like it. I really expected I was like, oh, it's going to be gross. It's going to be too powerful. Durian is so good. I'm like, don't mess with durian. Don't even mess with it. Why would you add stuff to it? Uh, no, it's very good, Ivana. It's very good. So better what's, than what's the bean? Let's try the bean. Stinky beans. Stinky beans. Uh, yeah. Just eat it like that, no? Yeah. Nice. You like it, eh? Oh, this is the best way to have it. With stinky beans. Yep. The wow. stinky bean is a powerful flavor. Stinky wow. beans. Wow. There is a oil. raging party in my mouth. <laughs> Everyone's screaming and dancing. Oh my gosh. The stinky bean is like powerful. <laughs> oh, party in your mouth. Wow. What's happening in my mouth does not reflect the weather outside. Outside it's dreary. My mouth it's sunshine. Beach. It's like fireworks in wow. your mouth. Wow. It's fireworks in my mouth. 
the stinky bean has a whole other level to it. It just cranked it up an another notch. <laughs> wow. So um, stinky beans and papaya, good combo? Good combo. Wow. I think cucumber might be the best one, actually. You know what cucumber? Oh, I don't have any more cucumber. Okay, what's this one? Ladyfinger. Let's try Ladyfinger. Or this one. The... Ladyfinger. Okay, Ladyfinger. Mm, not that good. Okay, you gotta the crunch try. is really nice. You, you want some crunchy. Try. You gotta try this one too. That's the. What's this? Food. With what? Uh, I don't know. Maybe with rice or rice. With chicken. So I don't this, know. I'm like 99% sure I'm not gonna like this. Um, so I'm just gonna dip it. Yeah. I don't want to offend anybody, but that stuff is the worst food I've had in Malaysia. <laughs> oh <my. coughs> it's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. Mm. Is it fresh? I don't want to offend anybody. It's not. It's funny. It's like anchovies. Somehow they made anchovies worse. Anchovies yeah, are the worst thing you could possibly have. How could they be worse? I'm not trying to insult anybody. If you like it, you like it. But for me, I will never eat that again. Is that okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay, stick to your tempoya. Tempoya. Look at all the good food I got here, man. Well, we want it. That stuff is so. What's it called? Budu? Budu. Oh. Fermented. The strongest pizza. fermented, salty, fishy. <laughs> oh. All right. So I got the ikan bakar here. Ikan bakar. What's this inside, stuff? babe? I don't know. Let's try it. Coconut. Coconut. Mm -hmm. Why is Ooh, it yellow? The inside is good. Try oh, it. yellow coconut. Try it. Try it. The inside is good, right? Um. Um, it's okay. Tastes like, <laughs> like ikan. Tastes like ikan. Very okay. strong ikan flavor. Oof. Not sure what kind of ikan this is. Do you know? Um, is it tuna? No, tuna not tuna. Is tuna is gigantic. It might be a yeah. sardine. Oh, maybe. And then, let, me let us know in the comments, guys. I only know like three types of fish. I got <laughs> tuna, salmon, and sardine. That's about all I know. Maybe okay. mackerel. Let me just... Eat. Try this. This Try is, this is, where, this is heaven, babe. This is really nice. With the stinky beans. Stinky beans. And wait, 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 I got it. Oh, yeah, you're gonna love it, babe. Wow. Interesting, right? It's like durian and spicy and sour, tangy. Mm -hmm. Wow. Nice, right? I like it. Mm, it's hard to not like it. And the sticky bean has a whole other level of flavor because mm. it's another strong flavor. Wow. Wow. Temple Yak is for strong flavor lovers. Wow. It's spicy, which is strong. It's <laughs> durian, which is strong. It's stinky bean, which is strong. It's the trifecta of overpowering yum yums. It wakes me up, man. It wakes me up. I was kind of sleepy before this, but this same. wakes me up. Same, Ivana, same. <laughs> you don't need coffee, you just need wow. tempoyak. For if breakfast. you're going to run a race, <laughs> you should have some tempoyak, you'll come first place in the race. <laughs> it gives you energy. Wow. It's mm. like. Exactly the right. Wow. Exactly right. Wow. Uh, it's good. I like it. It's I good, like right? it. You want to try this? You're gonna love this. Eggplant Ooh. sambal. You're gonna love okay. it. I'm telling you, it's so good. Let's try. Mmm. But it's sambal. It's good, right? It's not too spicy. No. But it's flavorful. And By the way, they got like seven different sambals. It says on their poster there. Mm, okay. Okay. Yep. Seven different sambals that you can try. They even have. Pineapple sambal. I want to try that one. Oh, that mm. one sounds really good. Yeah. Sambal nanas. Yeah. Pineapple sambal. So, sounds really good. good. Mm -hmm. So, overall, this restaurant, I think, deserves a five-star rating. Yeah. Let Everything's me, been really good here. Let me try uh, the fish with this. Oh my Ooh. gosh, if you like this, I don't know. What does that say about me? If you like this and you also like me, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Hmm. You like it. I kind of like it. Really? Yeah. Oh, That's, wanna... but it, oh my gosh. Oh, you're insane. Oh my gosh. You just poured like 20 <laughs> mils. 20 milliliters. Oh my gosh. Oh, my spine just jiggled. I just watched you eat that and my spine went. Oh. Mm, it's good. Mm. Oh. Eat it with some ulam. I don't even know what kind of leaves these are. Mm. Mm. Mint. I don't know. Tastes like, tastes like mint. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, good guess. Steve. And we got this uh, 
bottle kacang. Uh, star. Bottle, bottle bean. Bottle bean. Mm -hmm. Which just tastes like cucumber. Yeah. Tastes like cucumber. And we got another one here. They have so many different types of veggies. Yeah. Or This one. This one doesn't have a taste or flavor. Yeah. It's just kind of like bland. Oh, it's a little bit bitter. Whoa. Okay. Very good. I kind of like this. There you have it, guys. The Voodoo. fact that you like that makes me question pretty much everything you like. I mean, <laughs> what kind of human being? No, I'm just kidding, guys. Everyone's taste buds are different. I'm sure it's good for some people, mm. but for me, oh, not for me, guys. Mm. Oh, there's a nice bite. Crunchy, salty, fishy. There you go, Ivana. Mm. By the way, mm. I just got an idea. What if I mix the tempoyak with this? Tempoyak and voodoo? Yeah. I think your head might explode. <laughs> Let's see if it's good. Tempoyak and voodoo. Honestly, Ivana, good idea. Not so much for flavor, but definitely interesting. Tempoyak and voodoo. Oh, this rain. <laughs> Tempoyak and voodoo. Dun, dun, mix it dun. with rice? Really? Good. Really? Mm -hmm. Tempoyak and voodoo is good. Yeah. Wow. That mm. proves you like anything. <laughs> good. Wow. Five stars. Okay, there you have it, guys. Sembo tempoyak. They sell it to, for home use. Yeah. They That's sell good. this. Yeah. We also just learned that this is not voodoo. Oh, this thank is you. This is Assam something. This is voodoo. Sambal yeah. Assam. This is voodoo. Oh, that means I have so to try, try it. it again. Oh, man. <laughs> okay. Take two. Yes. Voodoo, take two. Okay, so Steve is gonna try the voodoo. Thought I already did this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, got some rice here. Gonna give it a good old dip. Dip and rip. <laughs> <coughs> so this wasn't that bad then. The awesome. Oh. I think it was <laughs> deep. I think it was in your head because this wasn't voodoo. That's gross. This, this is Assam. Awesome. Listen, guys. Everyone's taste buds are different. I don't mean it's nothing personal. This is bad. Voodoo is, I think, worse. <laughs> oh, there's not even one part of it that it can redeem it. It's not like it's okay. It's not my favorite, but I like this part of it. It's like it's just really bad. Salty, fishy, strong. <laughs> Wow! <laughs> Amazing that the first one wasn't voodoo. That might have been all just in my head. I think so. So what is it? What's in the first one? We don't even know. It's Assam something. Assam is the... Sour. I cannot remember the English word. Does Assam mean sour? Yeah. Assam is the sour fruit. Prune? No, the brown one. Date? We used it to cook Assam laksa. The sour... Juice. Prune? No, it's not prune. Damn, I gotta Google this. Hold on, keep guessing, we can get it. Listen, special thanks to the guy who came over and showed us that this was not voodoo, or else we would have got killed in the comments again. That's not even voodoo. <laughs> um, it's gotta be anchovies in there. I tasted anchovies in there. I didn't make up the fish flavor. Maybe it's mixed with asap. I was already prepared to not like voodoo, so when I tasted that, it tasted bad, I just figured it was voodoo. <laughs> <laughs> not for me, guys. Good for some, not for all. Okay, let me try the voodoo. Okay. All right, it's a voodoo redo. Voodoo redo. Voodoo okay. redo. Let me put some lime. Lime in the voodoo? Mix it with onion. I will say, for a bad food, great name. Fun to say. Voodoo. Some right? Chili. Chili in the voodoo? Lime in the voodoo? Yeah. Okay. A little bit of rice. Dip it? Dip no. it and rip it. I'm just gonna put this on top. Okay. Yeah, that's legit. All right, here goes nothing. Voodoo redo. Oh, go ahead. Rice with voodoo. What's the color? Is so not appetizing. Like gray. So much gray food is there. Oh, look at the eyebrows. Wow. <laughs> it is really salty. It is Woo! definitely really salty. So salty. It's not fishy for me, but. It's so super salty. Mm. So do you prefer voodoo or Assam? 
I prefer Assam. Wow. And I prefer Tempoya even more. Tempoya is amazing. This is five stars. Five stars. Yeah, Tempoya. Really mm -hmm. good. Is, other than a great name, mm -hmm. there's nothing about it that appetizes me. Even it looks just like, I mean, there's not much that color food. It's just kind of like a... Oh. Brown. Brown and kind of gray. With smash up anchovies. Gray brown. It's not only anchovies, it's fermented anchovies. Fermented anchovies. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh. good experience. Okay, guys. <laughs> now that we've actually tried everything, let's finish our meal. Then let's see if we can wander around today and find something fun to do. Nice. Let's go. Bye. All right, there you have it, guys. Sagang Budu. Oh, Budu in the title. Yeah. Just figure that out now. Very clever guy I am. Just met the owner there. Nice guy. Uh, special thanks to our friends, Food and Footprints, Greg and Jumi. I'm sure you know their channel. Yes. World famous food vloggers recommending this place to us. All the food there was really good, to be honest. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, Budu is not for me, but good quality food. And then obviously, Tempoyak, off the charts good. Special Tempoyak with stinky beans. Stinky Spatai. bean Tempoyak. Quite nice. Ooh, it's hard to rainy. hard to dislike something with that much durian flavor in it. That's true. We love durian. All right, so let's go rest for a bit, and then we'll go check out some uh, markets. Yeah, we can find one. See you there. All right, we did make it to a night market, guys, but we forgot that in Terengganu, Sunday isn't the weekend. The weekend is Friday, Saturday. I think the tempoyak was so good, we forgot what day of the week it was or what part of the country we're in. So we did find some interesting stuff, but other than getting dinner, it wasn't really much vlogging. It was like five or seven stalls lined up. We got nasi lemak, which was like really, really good. And we had some deep fried chicken feet, which were not quite as good. Although the next morning we did find a stall that sells nasi de gung at us toll. So we had our redemption meal. We got some nasi de gung for breakfast. We covered it in the gravy. And I am ashamed to admit that I kind of prefer it without the gravy. I'm worried you guys are gonna hate me, but I kind of prefer nasi de gung without the fish gravy. Anyway, that's the vlog guys. Thanks for watching everybody. See you in the next video.